momentum booster for you guys for Sunday? Yeah, definitely. I mean, everybody's on high spirits right now, and we're, we're feeling confident, and we're ready for Seattle. What do you guys have to do to rebound? I mean, this was a physically demanding game tonight. Yeah, I'm sure we're going we're gonna to have a nice recovery practice tomorrow and probably light trainings leading up to the game, but you know, we're professionals. We're going to be ready come Sunday. Talk about the importance of having more of back on the field, especially on that goal for you. Oh yeah, it's huge. I mean, he's he's a great passer of the ball. Like you give him the ball under pressure, he's always going to hold it, and he's always going to find whoever's in the most open space. So having him on the field for us is huge. What are your expectations against Seattle? I mean, we expect to win. That's why we're going out there. You seem to have a lot of emotion after uh, after that goal. Can you talk about the emotions? have when you score such an important goal like that yeah it's just like over you don't even know what to feel I mean you're excited you're happy everybody's cheering it's just like an overwhelming feeling like you just got to scream <laughs> like that's how I felt like I just needed to scream can you talk about the crowd tonight obviously by number maybe not the biggest crowd a tough situation three days later but it seems to be one of the loudest crowds I've seen. yeah I mean I think it was the loudest crowd we've had especially there at the end of the game it was just Almost deafening noise. It was it was amazing. It was like fantastic atmosphere. What was that experience like for you as a rookie? Uh, so many emotions. You, you you think you know what a playoff game is going to be like. How did it measure up to your expectations and, and just your thoughts on that? Yeah, it was definitely more intense than I was expecting. But you know, having everybody else be intense, it just kind of feels you on. We're, we're all feeding off of each other, so it was more intense than I was expecting. But I think we did all right. And. Uh, Apologies if this has been asked, but obviously having Morrow back on the field, the guy who played you a perfect ball, what does him being back on the field mean to the team? Yeah, it's huge because he's, he's the kind of guy that can hold onto the ball under pretty much any sort of pressure, and he's always going to find the right pass. So having him, is, he's just the perfect link player on our team. And then on the goal, did you, when you took that first touch, did you feel like it had gotten past you, or did you feel good on that first touch? I still felt good. I mean, I had the goal wide open, so I still felt alright about it. And a good finish, you're proud of? <laughs> yeah, his goal is a goal, right? Vote for Tesho? Vote for Tesho, always. <laughs> Well, for Pedro too. Uh, talk about the lead-in. It seemed like everybody in the stadium was waiting for him to pass the ball to him. Just you know, that wide open. What was going through your head as, as you're waiting for him to lead through those players? Yeah, I, I knew he was going to pass me the ball once he broke through, so I was just trying to get as open as I could so when I controlled it, I wouldn't be under pressure right away. What's going through your mind when the referee blows the whistle? At the end of the game? Yeah. Just relief, you know. Right when the whistle blows is when you feel tired. Yeah. Like, up until then, I wasn't too tired, but when the whistle hit, my legs died. and. But it was just relief and, you know, on to the next one now. So you, always, you guys have played Vancouver multiple times by now, but it's so personal. You know, um, I feel like there's some bloodshed on the field. I guess from your personal experience from playing with them in tonight's game, what was more personal than the other games? And I noticed that, you know, about half of the possession was y'all. Can you explain, like, what led y'all to be more possessive, maybe more aggressive this game than past games? I think because we just knew it was a must-win game, you know. We, we kind of were all like, we need to give it all we got, otherwise we're not coming in tomorrow. So I think that kind of fueled us to play better. And on a night that you're giving out vote for Tesho buttons and you get a goal to get the tone started, can it be said that you should be the rookie of the year? I mean, there's great competition, so I'll leave it up to the, the people who decide. It's not my choice. Good luck on Sunday, sir. Thanks.